On November 2, 1945, a man in a U.S. Navy uniform approached Thora Chamberlain requesting that she babysit his sister's children for the afternoon. She accepted the offer, but was never seen again. Thomas Henry McMonagall, a San Mateo resident with a history of arrests, drew immediate attention from law enforcement. He admitted to finding a stolen uniform and medals from a real serviceman. His accounts of the murder were inconsistent, sometimes claiming accidental death from a shooting or a fall from his car. Authorities recovered the bullet and car parts with traces of blood, confirming the bullet's origin from his .32 caliber Colt revolver. He claimed to have disposed of Chamberlain's body off the cliff, while police found her belongings, but her body remained missing. The jury swiftly reached a guilty verdict, resulting in his sentencing to the gas chamber, but in his final statement before his execution in 1948, he strangely denied any involvement in Chamberlain's disappearance.